Before the video starts, I have a small request. I've launched a second channel called Tour Encyclopedia, where we explore the most fascinating and beautiful places around the world. If you're interested in travel, make sure to check it out and subscribe. The link is in the description below this video. And now, let's dive into the main episode. Israel Upgrades Iron Dome Air Defense System As aerial threats to Israel continue to escalate, the Ministry of Defense announced an upgrade to the Iron Dome Air Defense System. This enhancement follows a rocket barrage launched by Hamas towards central Israel, marking the first such attack since October 7 of the previous year. According to the Ministry of Defense, the improvements aim to strengthen the system's interception capabilities against current threats while preparing for future challenges, including cruise missiles and drones. Developed and manufactured by Rafael Advanced Defense Systems, Iron Dome is a mobile system designed to intercept short-range rockets, 155mm artillery shells, and mortar projectiles. It operates within 5 to 70 km range and remains effective in various weather conditions, including low clouds, rain, sandstorms, and fog. Its architecture integrates a detection and tracking radar, a battle management and weapon control system, and a firing unit equipped with interceptor missiles. This modular design allows for rapid deployment to protect strategic infrastructure, urban areas, and military units in transit. The system's radar, the EL-M2084 developed by ELTA Systems, detects incoming projectiles, tracks their trajectory, and determines their potential impact zone. Advanced algorithms assess whether an interception is necessary, prioritizing threats that pose a direct risk while conserving interceptors for critical engagements. Once a threat is identified, data is transmitted to the battle management system developed by Impressed Systems, which evaluates the tactical situation in real time and authorizes the launch of an interceptor if required. Iron Dome's interception capability relies on the Tamir missile, a maneuverable interceptor designed to neutralize airborne threats. Equipped with electro-optical sensors and a radar seeker, the missile adjusts its trajectory to maximize interception accuracy. Measuring 3 meters in length and weighing 90 kilograms, it is designed to detonate near its target, reducing collateral damage. A single Iron Dome battery consists of three launchers, each carrying 20 Tamir missiles, allowing for up to 60 interceptors before reloading is required. Beyond its deployment in Israel, the Iron Dome has drawn international interest. In 2020, the United States acquired two batteries to enhance its air defense capabilities. In 2022, Romania also expressed interest in purchasing the system. Its adaptability enables its use for both fixed site protection and the defense of military bases, command centers, and mobile units. Its ability to counter various threats, including Hamas Qasem rockets, Hezbollah's Katyusha missiles, and Iranian-supplied FAR rockets, makes it a versatile defensive solution. The recent upgrade was led by the Directorate of Defense Research and Development DDRND, in collaboration with Rafael. These enhancements are based on operational experience, particularly in response to the increased use of explosive drones by groups such as Hezbollah and the Houthis. These drones, often small and flying at low altitudes, present detection challenges due to their low radar signature and slow speed. The integration of advanced detection and interception technologies enhances Iron Dome's ability to counter these evolving threats. Moshe Patel, head of the Israel Missile Defense Organization, stated that recent tests validated new capabilities informed by battlefield conditions. Rafael CEO, Yov Turgman, emphasized that more than a decade after its deployment, Iron Dome continues to evolve to address emerging operational challenges. The latest tests confirmed the effectiveness of these upgrades, reinforcing the system's role in Israel's defense strategy. As part of this modernization, Israel has placed a substantial order for additional interceptor missiles. The procurement, funded by an $8.7 billion aid package provided by the Biden administration, includes $5.2 billion allocated specifically for Iron Dome and David Sling interceptors, as well as the continued development of the Megan or Laser Defense System, designed by Rafael and Elbit Systems. With the nature of aerial threats constantly evolving, these upgrades highlight the need for continuous adaptation of Israel's defense systems. The improvements ensure that the Iron Dome remains a central component of the country's protection strategy, maintaining its effectiveness against a broad range of threats.
Thank you for watching.